My name is Amira Nadira. Today, we are going to present about the pros and cons of synchronous class. Hello madam, my name is Natasha Nicole Stanis and my matrix number is 07-DHR19F1017 So the first question is Synchronous session will often rely on things like video conferencing which is in turn hugely reliant on having enough bandwidth to support it 71.4% uh, of respondent answer yes and 26.6% of respondent answer no Next question, synchronous learning is one of the key methods of delivery for distance education and focuses on involving the entire learning group in real time. 66.7% of respondent answer yes and 16.7% of respondent answer no. 16.7% of respondent answer false. Hello madam, my name is Nurul Tatin Ashkin Binti Lawrence. My matrix number is 07 dhr 19 f 1004 So, question number 3. Synchronous learning can be burdened for a student that live in a rural class and a very large majority student choose yes. Question number four. Online learning can be much easier to understand when synchronous learning is conducted and 66.7% student choose yes, 60.7% choose no and another 60.7% student choose false. For the question five, which is yes, no question, there is seven responses. From the pie chart, we can see that for the yes response, uh, take 71.4%. And for the no responses, take 28.6%. And for the last question, which is true or false, there are six responses. Um, overall, from the pie chart, the no responses take the highest percent, which is 83.3% and 16.7% for yes respondent.